أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وجزاء سيئة سيئة مثلها فمن عفا وأصلح فأجره على الله إنه لا يحب الظالمين The repayment of a bad action is one equivalent to it. But if someone pardons and puts things right, his reward is with Allah. Certainly he does not love wrongdoers. This is a story about two friends, Zayd and Akil. These two friends were one day walking through the desert. At one point during the trip they started arguing and Zayd sadly hit Akil on his face. Akil was very hurt, but without a further word, he wrote down in the sand, Today, my best friend hit me in the face. They carried on walking until they came across an oasis, where they decided to freshen up. However, right before leaving, Akil got caught up in the mud and was about to drown. Suddenly, Zayd extended his arm to help Akil, therefore saving his life. After Akil had recovered, he wrote down on a stone, Today, my best friend saved my life. Zayd was very confused. As they continued on walking, Zayd asked his dear friend, After I hit you, you wrote in the sand. But when I had saved your life, you decided to write on a stone. Why? Akil smiled and graciously looked at his friend, then answered, when someone hurts us, we should write it down on sand, so that as the wind blows it away, we too should forgive and blow away our hurt feelings. But when someone does something nice for us, we should engrave it in a stone, similarly engraving into our hearts. As the Holy Quran teaches us in Surah Ashura, Ayah 40, that Allah's reward is for those who forgive and pardon others. So learn to write down your pain in the sand and engrave your happiness in stone.